Hey everybody, Stefan here from Milford Station and uh, we're going to be going through some of our stuff that we sold in the last few days and uh, this is the first time for us doing this so just bear with us, uh, it's going to get refined as we get along. But uh, I'm going to go and show some of the stuff that we sold and then I'll let my beautiful wife Kelly go come up here and she can show uh, some of the other stuff that we sold and we'll take turns like that. But uh, without further ado, let's get started. So. Uh, one of the things we sold, got these here, these big monsters, and they are hiking boots of some sort. They're called Zamberlands. Uh, I don't know if you can see this, but Zamberland is a very reputable boot. I don't know a lot about them, like I said, but the comps were showing fairly high on these, so they're very sought after. These sold probably about four or five days after we listed them. Uh, which tells me I probably should have been asking a little bit more, but they're the Vibram soles, which are really good, all leather, and they weigh a ton. Like, these are not going to be cheap to ship. Uh, we're in Canada up here, so uh, our shipping is a little through the roof, but, you know, we make do with it. Uh, we sold these. They're going to Colorado, so I figure probably about $20 to ship these down there. But then, and uh, what we did... Um, we priced them up about a little under what we saw most comps out there, but we still man, we got eight ninety dollars US on these uh, shipping, and we paid from an auction, if I remember correctly, these we paid about twelve bucks for these things. So um, good flip on these things, good profit, and I'll pick these up any day. Uh, okay, next item uh, since we're on footwear is a pair of Rockport. Uh, dress shoes or casual shoes they are uh, you know the standard shoes you'd wear in an office I guess uh, Rockport is a really good name for men's shoes uh, good quality well built and comfortable uh, if these were my size I'd probably keep them for myself but they're size 13 or a couple sizes too big for me uh, but uh, nice pair of shoes and I think we paid uh, through our local auction here we paid probably six dollars I, I try not to pay any more than six or seven dollars for footwear and we sold these for 27 us dollars uh shipped so another good flip right there uh next is these four dvd movies um with dvds i try not to pick them up um i find that they're a lot of work to list and uh, what i do is i if i do pick them up i make sure that i i get them for almost nothing like 25 a quarter a piece or more and buy them in lots or boxes at a yard sales or wherever. Uh, these ones I lotted up. I have these four movies here. Um, Fool's Gold, Sanders Dream, Deadly Drifter, Stone. Uh, I haven't seen any of these, so maybe I should watch them before I ship them out. But anyways, they sold for $16 and $15 shipping. So buyers about $32 all in for these four movies so you know I probably paid about a quarter each so good flip good profit on these ones um, next thing I sold is this thing uh, I don't know if there's a name for them but they're uh, the under-the-counter Sony CD player radio alarm whatever you want to call it but these are actually a good uh, pick a good find uh, every time I see these I will pick them up because they do sell and they sell fairly quickly uh, this one I picked up uh, and I paid roughly about five or six dollars if I remember correctly and it sold probably about a month later and it sold for uh, I'm not sure so but yeah so just I'll put up the comps uh, of course uh, by the time you see this video I'll have comps coming up here and you'll be seeing the pricing of what is shipped sold at uh, but yeah de definitely pick these up these are a good find uh, people are still looking for these and are still using them and uh, so they're a little heavy but make sure when you do list them that you include, um, you know, compensate for the shipping charges wherever you are at. All right, next is a video game. And this is a Forza Motorsport 4. Uh, it's one of the game that comes in a special edition pack, which is uh, kind of a metal box. And you open it up, there's two DVDs. I know this uh, game is a very, um, one of, it's a big seller for Xbox 360, uh, this race game and just a collector's 10 makes it uh, that much more valuable so yeah so this game uh picked it up for five dollars sold it for 27 us dollars shipped so definitely a good flip here i made you know it's a quick 20 bucks and uh, 
you know, that's it. Uh, next is teapot. You can see like we're all over the place. We're going from shoes to um, electronics to video games, movies, teapots. We sell everything. We pay, if, if I see value in something and it's priced fairly and I know it's going to sell, I pick it up. So this teapot, it's a Price in Kensington, um, made in England. Very one or two cup teapot. So it's a small, small little decorative teapot, but definitely if you someone that would live alone that wants to have tea and not waste any water could use this teapot and it would be perfect. So yeah, so sold for 25 US dollars or no, I think it was like 22 or 23. Anyways, there you have it. Next is this Dirt Devil filter in a badly beat up box, which I certainly showed in the pictures and in the listing, I divulged that, but the filter itself is uh, in a brand new condition. We picked these up for about 10 cents and uh, they were basically giving them away. So I picked them all up. Uh, what I do is I go on the Canadian Tire website in their clearance section, they show all these things. I can buy them right from home and go pick them up uh, from their um, locker that they have set up there. You just go, you pay for it, you pick it up in the locker. So Anissa, uh, this sold for $13.50 with $15 shipping. So buyer was about $29 all in for this filter that I paid 10 cents for. So good flip. Um, it's gonna cost nothing to ship. This will go first class, no problem. But uh, another good flip, I'll pick these up all the time. Next thing is, uh, I try to pick these things up all the time. Anything that's still new in the wrapping, um, even if I didn't know what it was. But what it is, it's a 1200 GPH, which is uh, gallons per hour. It's an aerator pump, uh, tsunami model. Uh, basically it's for uh, people with boat fishing boats that have a, uh, a bilge that needs to be pumped out and uh, this basically pumps out your boat so that you don't sink which is a good thing I suppose but it's a bilge pump basically for a boat all right and uh, I was picked this up I paid I believe about four dollars four or five dollars for this thing and it sold for, let's see, $54.18 shipping. So the buyer was all in about $72, give or take. Uh, so pretty good flip on this. Um, I'll pick this up all the time. Like I said, this is a, um, you know, buyers will be specifically looking for these things. There's not a whole lot of them on eBay. So when you do list these, uh, they do sell. And uh, it's usually for good money, especially when they're brand new in the wrapper like this. Next is these vision. I got these two vision pots here. Uh, this is a one liter and I have a 1.5 liter, I believe. One's a cr the cranberry, which tends to sell for more. They're both one liters. Uh, and they got the little spout on them. These things I pick up for about two or three dollars at my local thrift thrift shops. I will pick these Vision cookware pots ev all the time because they, they sell fast and they're in high demand and you can usually command pretty good profit on these things. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I don't remember how much we sold them for but it was definitely in the 20 to $25 price range anyways you'll see it on the comps when they, they put them up uh, but yeah pick these up all the time these are good they're easy to clean uh, they're solid even though they're made out of glass they do weigh a little bit so make sure you compensate uh, in your pricing for shipping uh, but they are you know easy to ship easy to pack and people like them that's it so vision vision wear pots speaking of pots uh, this one here which is a Kirkland which I believe is our Costco house brand pot, but this is a very high quality pan or saute pan. Uh, it's Kirkland 3.3 quarts, Kirkland signature, professional quality, all the good stuff, uh, stainless steel with a copper ring and it, it weighs pretty good. So this, this is a solid pot. Uh, you could defend your home with this, no problem. <laughs> um, you could definitely protect your family with this pot, oh as well as cook a good meal and uh, so definitely a good buy uh, we sold this for this much uh, forget how much I paid for it but it's probably in 
around six or seven dollars but i guarantee it sold for quite a bit more than that but uh yeah pots and pans really good uh um, hustling hooks yeah hustling hooks hashtag hustling hooks uh that's i would never have believed that i'd be scrubbing pots at two in the morning um to make money on the side with but, ketchup uh, i will do it all the time yeah ketchup believe it or not ketchup cleans pots really well and uh it's an excuse for me to have more ketchup in the house so because it's uh it's great anyways that's it for me i'm gonna let my lovely wife come in and she can show you uh the other half of what we saw the last few days thank you Hey, it's Kelly from the Milford Station. I'm going to do the second part of what's sold in the last couple of days. So this is anti-aging day cream number seven, Protect and per Perfect Intense Advanced. And it's brand new. And we probably picked this up. I, we picked up a lot of makeup for, we paid about a dollar per piece. So we would have about a dollar into this. And I can't remember what we had it listed for, but we did take an offer of $20 US. So a dollar into 20, we do this all day. Okay. Uh, another thing that sold this, week, this weekend were, were these um, Converse All Stars, like the American flag, red white and blue the stars um i think we picked these up in the in an uh auction and we probably paid about five dollars for them and they sold for so we made a really good profit on that and they're in excellent condition very clean and we love to sell converse okay another thing we sold was this Pavilion chest teacher, uh, great for beginners. It's in a, in a, I guess it's tin, I don't know, kind of a box. And I actually picked up a bunch of games off Facebook Marketplace for free. Uh, and this was in it, so we got it for free. And we sold it for, ta -da! So we made a really good profit on it. Um, Okay, the next thing that I'm showing you is it's the Game of Life. It, all pieces are in here. We always check and make sure we don't sell any incomplete games because that's just not a really good thing to do. Uh, we bought this, I don't know, probably paid $5 for it. We don't really like to pay more than that for games. And it's sold for $31.50 and that's shipped. Uh, all of our things, well actually no, not everything. Most of our listings are shipped. So a price, but that's shipped. Um, we do have some listings that add shipping on it, but we have been doing free shipping for uh, about a month, I guess. So yeah, so the game of life, uh, $31.50. Okay, this is a Monopoly Star Wars game. The box is a little banged up, but when uh, we take pictures and we disclose all that because, you know, just, if you disclose it, you're not gonna have any problems, really. All the pieces are here. And with Monopoly games, every time we see one, if it's a reasonable price, I mean, we're not gonna pay $20 for one, but, uh, what, four or five dollars, and we pick it up because Monopoly games, we sold four Monopoly games in it in one day, in 24 hours last weekend. And so, yeah, Monopoly games do really well for us. Um, so we probably picked this one up for $4 or so and it sold for what's showing over here on the screen. What are these? Okay. And these shoe, they're Steve Madden. And they're in excellent condition. It's a little bit of, you know, wear right here, but other than that, they're perfect. They're women's. I'm not really sure. I, we probably got these from the, from the online auction uh, 
near us as well. And like I said, we're not, we don't want to pay more than four or five dollars for uh, a pair of shoes, but we will go a little bit higher if you know we're going to get a hundred dollars for a pair of shoes. We'll pay up to probably fifteen or so. But yeah, so we got these off in the auction, and we haven't had them very long, and they sold for. Okay, this, okay, all those, all the sales that Stefan showed you and what I showed you were from eBay. This sale is one from Poshmark. Uh, we don't, well, we have quite a few listings on Poshmark, uh, but we don't spend as much time with that. We really focus on our eBay uh, platform. So one, one woman bought this purse. Which is it's a really nice purse with the fringes um, inside it's a, it's a juicy couture purse or sorry a kiss me couture which I think is juicy couture uh, yeah so she bought she did a bundle so she bought this purse a strap that needs to be a little bit fixed Okay, I guess. Um, and this Roller Lines Eyeliner from Benefit. And Benefit's an excellent brand. And this is uh, part of the lot we got with the number seven cream. So we have a dollar into this. And she also bought this eyeliner, which is Stila, S-T-I-L-A. And it's a micro tip. Um, Stay all day waterproof liquid eyeliner and it's intense black. So all three of those are going to somebody and they're from Posh. So we did more sales and we will show you another time in a what sold video. Thank you.